here on my route that I do as much as I can. I love it, it's right on the, the precipice of the city in between country and city. Get out here and really feel like I'm escaping. And I get to cruise by some farm stands, coffee shops, and really sort of unplugs me from the city. And the riding's really beautiful. Well, Cadence has been around for almost 12 years. We specialize in things like bike fitting and training and coaching and indoor classes as well as retail. Maniunk is kind of the outskirts of the city and the beginning of the suburbs and the good road riding. So we are right across the street from the mountain bike trails and we're basically at the beginning of where the road riding starts. Well the cool thing about Philadelphia is that you can kind of see everywhere from your bike. And really, if you want to get to Center City, Philadelphia from almost anywhere else in the city, it shouldn't take you longer than a half hour bike ride at most. Everywhere is pretty accessible, uh, partially because our city is flat, partially because we have a relatively advanced bike lane network. The topography of the Wissahickon Valley is pretty amazing. We have a vertical drop of over 100 feet from the top of the park to the bottom of the park. We have about 34 miles of trail. That's out of 50 miles of upper trail, park-wide. About two-thirds of the park is open to mountain biking, and the Wissahickon itself has been the signature architect of the landscape of northwestern Philadelphia. Mountain biking in Philadelphia is really unique and special to me, mostly because I have access to so many trails within a seriously metropolitan area. What makes Wissick and riding so cool for a mountain biker is how fast it can change. We've got punchy climbs, pretty rough descents in areas. A very well-rounded rider can be produced by this area, and it's a very beautiful place. You know, this is a good scene, and we'll see where the trails go with that. <laughs>